Hey guys, so I just picked up this Toro 21 inch recycler mower. So it's a mulching mower and it also has the catcher with it as well. And it's actually locked up at the moment. I cannot uh, pull it over. So um, we need to figure out what that is. Now this is an E-series, they have a plastic cam in there. It could be that, it could be internal, it could be something simple. I'll start with just getting the plug out and we'll see if we can move that piston up and down. Maybe we'll try and spin the blade over, see what it is. But uh, I thought I'd bring you along. Hopefully it's a simple fix. These E-series, they, uh, they tend to be a little bit fragile. So uh, let's see. Pulled the plug out and a whole bunch of oil came blowing out of the cylinder. So maybe it was stored on its side. It was just hydrolock that I was dealing with. Well, I've just drained the oil out because it was hugely overfilled, which isn't that surprising. So I think all it was, was someone just put too much oil in it. There's no metal particles, there's no rainbow effect going on in there. So uh, I think that's good, but we're at the right level now. <laughs> there we go. Well, doesn't sound bad at all. It was just hydrolocked. we have it it was literally that simple whoever owned it overfilled it with oil and uh, it probably smoked when they first got it running a lot and then they left it inside their shed came back to it next time and found out that uh, you couldn't pull it over at all and they threw it away I came and found it and it was just hydrolocked a real simple easy fix and don't be surprised when you start a mower like that that's either been tilted to its side or Hydrolot like that with uh, oil. It's just it just needs to burn it off. So there we go And I don't foresee there being an issue, but let's just do a quick restart 